The matches themselves stretch over around a quarter of a century and they begin with that astonishing match at the Oval in 1968 where England squared the series after a violent thunderstorm had threatened to wash out most of the last day's play. They were uncovered pitches in those days. Just as astonishing was the fact that the spectators were called on to assist in drying the ground to make a start. Derek Underwood took seven for 50, England won by 226 runs, and the Australians, well, they lost their last five wickets for just 15. When we joined play, Derek Underwood has already disposed of Redpath, and here he is now, bowling to Ian Chappell. It seems to me that the balls from Underwood, which have turned this morning, have been pitched outside the off stump. And probably there is a little bit of rough there caused by the, the quicker bowlers. And that looked out certainly from here. And look at uh, Derek Underwood, absolutely thrilled. Given out by umpire Fag, a tremendous early blow for England. Doug Waters, the batsman, on one. That's out. Caught behind, and what a vicious delivery. Landing on or just outside leg stump and spinning shoulder high through to Alan Knott. Now Underwood at this end. To bowl to Mallet. He's out, caught, caught by Brown, and that one lifted, Brown delighted, not a difficult catch. Ten men round the bat. Doesn't matter about the fours or sixes, runs don't matter at all. Ooh, he's out, is he caught? Look at Brown, look at Dave Brown, he's gone, and that was a better catch. More difficult because he had to go right, right low for it. 14 minutes to go and two wickets to fall, Underwood to Gleeson. Coming in round the wicket this time, Underwood. And he got him, bowled him, off stump, knocked out of the ground, and Australia are 120 for nine. Whole test series depending on this. Ah! Appeal, he's out! He's out, WW, England have won! And the series is drawn. 1972 was a turning point in Australian cricket after their longest spell without a Test match victory. That was 11 games since the Old Trafford match of 1968. Here at the Oval, Australia squared the series under Ian.